Grant Hill and Chris Weber. I'm Brian Anderson. Allie LaForce will be joining. We are live in Boston, Massachusetts, the gem of New England, as the Celtics are about to go into this interconference contest right here. <laughs> Give a faggot dog. <laughs> I'm dead, bro. Valanciunas, good. Today, Greg, we see a lot more friendly rivals. Does that bother you? Not at all. I mean, people like to say, well, our era had the rivalries were more bitter. Um, I disagree with that. I, I think guys are every bit as competitive today as they've ever been. That's good to hear. Uh, they just also have more exposure and opportunity to be around one another. Kids today growing up, they've been planning. each other since the fifth sixth grade in national tournaments when we played we didn't get to see the other top players around the country so i think that was one reason why you didn't have a closeness with guys that unless you were on the same team now here's Morant. Oh, okay, wow. okay. As creative as they come, John ja Morant has a style that's specifically his. Brown. And Brown throws it down hard. Great job executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. Pass to Allen. Back to Morant. Memphis moving that ball around. Here's Valanciunas. Lays it up and banks it in. Valanciunas has got his second basket. Almost every move Valanciunas makes, there's going to be some contact. He just plays through it. From the sideline, let's catch up with Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Well, Brad Stevens and I got a chance to talk for a bit. I asked him about the task of slowing down Ja Morant. Coach said, the one thing you can't account for with Morant is his explosiveness. Everything else you can plan for, but sometimes he'll just beat you. And Kevin, that's what they mean when they say, good defense, better offense. Back to you. Thank you, David. A, a serious talent when Robert Williams is healthy. He makes his presence felt, has great length and lift off the floor. Defensively, he protects the rim and even blocks shots out on the perimeter. Here's Smart. And they double up Brown. Pass to Tatum. Back to Brown. And there's the foul. It's on Jalen Brown. That's his first foul. And then offensively, Williams is mostly a rim runner at this point. But, Greg, there are signs that the jumper is coming along. Yeah, you know, when he was drafted at the end of the first round, there was a lot of talk about rebuilding his shot mechanics. And that's still a work in progress. But where he's really impressed people is with his passing. He has terrific instincts for the game. Tatum drives in. And slam dunk by Tatum. And, and Tatum is clever when he's in attack mode. Great at beating defenders to the basket. Offensive rebound. Pass to Dallin Tunis. Here's Jackson. Goes up with it again. And the layup is up and in. Yeah, going hard to the rack. Making a statement here early on. 
well. This is his game. Be proactive offensively. Put the defense back on his heels. And they double up Brown. Williams gets the bucket. You know, when Williams gets positioned inside, he just looks to dominate physically, and then he shows you the skill set on top of it. Here's Valanciunas. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. In this period, they're feeding him, and he's feeling it. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Grizzlies. Guys, their willingness to attack the basket so far has been great. They're penetrating, finding holes in the defense, and scoring from close range. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And the energy of Williams, it's infectious. Amazing at using it to block shots, rebound, score, whatever they ask of him. Now here's Morant. Anderson outside. Here's Helen Shunis. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Love the aggression that Valanciunas showed there. He welcomed the contact inside to get to the line. The Grizzlies shooting their second and third shots at the line right here. And he sinks the second. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Brown drives in. Pass to Tatum. And the rejection by Valanciunas. Those are the plays you want from Valanciunas on the defensive end. Didn't hesitate to challenge the shot. Into the lane. And the shot is good. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they shot the basketball. Brooks with it. Now guarded by Tatum. And that one's good. Morant. Morant got his second bucket. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Inside, Morant with the steal. Anderson trying to free himself up. And that one's good, Morant. Morant got six. And they have owned the paint so far, and the score reflects it. I'll tell you, this was their strategy coming in. They obviously identified a weakness there inside. Score the basket. His fourth. He's only missed one of his five shots tonight. Defensively, they've been a step slow here to start. And it's Jason Tatum with the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game. Oh, great defense there. Anticipated the play and got there first. Oh, wow. <laughs> they have been excellent so far, coming in with a well-balanced attack. And it's helped them build an early lead. They just need to stay aggressive. John Moran has been leading the charge. Yo. He got into double digits for the quarter with 10 points total. tuning in we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback and guys the Grizzlies enjoying a nice lead here way to set the table offensively they dominated on the interior they came in looking to attack from the get-go willing to be physical and setting the tone that's a block Anderson outside Memphis moving that the ball. Bit guy is slashing bash. Eesh. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on John Morant. That's his first foul. Celtics trail by 10. Ah, oh, that shit ass. And he fix that charge and shit. And then Brown with the dunk. <laughs> and just awesome speed from Brown. Blasting off towards the bucket and slamming it down. Jason Tatum, he got a lot of the pub last year, and deservedly so. But Jalen Brown made monstrous strides as well, especially when it came to efficiency. Here he goes. And the rejection by Valanciunas. We start with the money. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. That one on smart. 
the ability to stop and start, change pace. Morant a handful off the dribble. And you look at Brown's field goal percentage and his free throw percentage, Greg, both career highs last season. And Kev, his shot was never broken. The, the motion never had to be rebuilt. Brown's problem coming into the league was... This match had Okazino bet 50K on the bet, bro, but doesn't want to put his daughter for college. What the fuck? <laughs> I'll tell you what, it's like, I think he thought that was... It's like she loved me, but she hate the... Outside Tatum. She get busted off. Loads it up for Williams. Stolen by Anderson. Morant with a wide open look. Kept alive. And he elevates for the slam dunk. Jason Tatum. Anderson outside. Good and nice. Today. Hey, Kev. Remember, uh, you know that college, that college, uh, player from Kentucky that died in an accident? If he was the Boston Celtics, because I guess Boston Celtics were projected to take him. If he was Boston, would you still... Draft them like a sign of like commemoration and still pay like the parents like Yeah, I guess he was projected to go to Boston <laughs> And the nigga died before a draft bruh So would, uh, if he was the Boston Celtics owner would you still pay the family? Like <laughs> I've seen that shit <laughs> Bro, I was dying. <laughs> I was dying when I seen that shit. Someone on Twitter said, The Boston Celtics should still play the parents like a million dollars. And they were gonna, like, what? I was like, oh. I was like, what? Dude. I think it is going to Houston. Damn, Scotty going to the league. What? Let me get that bread. If you think about it, if you think about it now, bro, like, this year, like, all the college players, everybody asked, they're not like, Ray Allen out of the draft, Kobe out of the draft, Kevin Garnett out of the draft, they just regular schmegular players now, bro. We already got the generational players on the, on, <laughs> on the every team, bro. I don't know who else, I don't know who in the draft right now is a generational player, bro. A nigga that you could look like, it, look at and be like, damn. That nigga's it. Zion got no shot, bro. Like, he... He's still losing, bro. Like... I don't know. Intentionally grabbed him there for some reason. I don't know. Kevin, Kevin, all I can think of is that he's trying to slow the game down a little bit. That's a stretch, though. Definitely a strange move on his part. Wow. Wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate there. And Parker drops them both. 
Greg, you really began to emerge and got on the national scene at UNLV, but you started your college career at Portland. You were actually named the conference freshman of the year. Uh, yeah, how about, I actually averaged more points in Portland than in any season I played at Vegas. Dreamer Green. Roles, but Portland's always yeah, have a, a sweet spot in my heart. My first child was born in the great city of Portland. And keeping us updated from the sideline, let's swing it over to David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin. Now, John Morant says in an era of five-star recruits, he was a no-star recruit coming out of high school. And that put that big chip on his shoulder. Now he has beneath no one tattooed on his arm. And he says, my dad always told me that I was trained to go. Basically, that I'm built for the moment. And guys, his time is now. Sure is, D.A., thank you. And finished off by Morant. What a night for John Morant. Showing off that versatility, and he's relentless at the offensive end. R.J. Barrett. Loads it up for Williams. Up high to stop the alley. -oop. What I really love about this kid, you know, Williams is that he's physical, he's explosive, and yes, he plays above the rim. He, he just brings that nastiness to the game. They're great. Side shooting, really fueling this run. Celtics trail by 21. And Zion don't got the. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play here for him. I got, I got Luca as a generational player, bro. A lot of natural strength. You can play him physical, but most of the time he's gonna win. It, is I, Luca is going to win. And not only is Smart one of the best defenders in the league, Greg, he's also one of the most versatile players in the NBA. Kevin, yeah, when you talk about players who can guard one through five, it's usually referring to Kawhi, PG-13, or Giannis. But Smart at 6'4 has the strength, the anticipation, and the toughness to hold his own against <laughs> anyone. It's remarkable. Williams with the steal. <laughs> Trying to break that ice cold streak. Better look at Chris Boss stats, bro. Brown. Brown's got eight points. A young guy with maturity, awareness, and a feel for the game. Tatum is special. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Brown drives in. And he goes big with the top right over John Moran. And what amazing athleticism from Brown putting on a show out there with slams like that. We've got 22 seconds left in the first half. Oh, what a play! What a play! I tell you what, don't sleep on Tatum. He had some ups. And I love seeing him trying to electrify the crowd. And yeah, he's not messing around. He wants no part of a comeback in this one. Reason why momentum can flip so quickly. We see it time and time again. Teams giving up big leads. See, like. Zion don't got the it factor. I don't see the it factor from him, bro. Celtics trail by 15. Brown drives in. Jeez. Williams finishing it Jeez. off. Jeez. Yeah, hard trying to keep Williams off the boards. He makes it a mission to keep possessions alive. And a wide open look for Valanciunas. Top of the key jumper, no good. Brown jams it in. <laughs> And I gotta say, sort of surprising he goes for a slam that difficult when they're trailing. Mm -hmm, but, but still, a magnificent move to the rim. Now the fast break. Tatum with the ball. Good, and Smart gets the assist. Tatum's got it back down to a single-digit deficit for Boston. Anderson outside. Valanciunas in the high post. 
eight points for him. Over Williams. Valanciunas, good. Valanciunas has got ten. That's where Valanciunas is a handful inside and on the block. <laughs> Williams with the ball. Started now by Jackson. <laughs> Pass to Tatum. Williams a screen. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. We know how important the draft is, Greg. It can it can shape an organization. Talk about some of the best draft day deals of the last couple decades. There have been a lot of them. Oh, there have been a few. I mean, just coming to mind here recently. How about when Kawhi? LeBron went to the finals. That was a, yes. a huge. That nigga LeBron went to the. Kobe LeBron went to the finals. Just, uh, yeah, LeBron went to the finals at a at at, at his third year. Yes, he did, dude. 2003 to the to 2007. That was the bro. It's 2006, 2007. That was. I'm talking about his fourth season, dude. <laughs> nope. <laughs> oh, but LeBron, LeBron took Booby. LeBron, LeBron took Booby Gibson. <laughs> LeBron put Booby Gibson. Yeah. No, say the name. Bonzo Ball, keep going. Bledsoe, keep going. Steven Adams, keep going. Say the whole team, bro. Keep going, keep going, bro. 18 points for him. No doubt about the consistency when it comes to scoring for the basketball tonight. A real nice lift for their LeBron, different, bro. <laughs> Lonzo Ball. <laughs> the right guys at the right time. The reason why they stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. Takes it inside. And what an incredible shot in the arm for this franchise. The opportunity to grab the potential superstar in Ja Morant. And they had only a percent <laughs> chance of landing that number two overall pick. So he gets them both. How can you not love a player like John Moran? <laughs> Stan, Stan, Van, Stan Van Gundy forces on to play point guard like LeBron did, like LeBron did his third year. Uh uh, bro. <laughs> you don't got the passing. Like Zion does not. Go ahead. They've had a lot of good players come through Memphis over the years. <laughs> Probably no one with Moran's upside. He has future league MVP. <laughs> Once the three point shot is consistent, and Zion does on the turnovers, and, and, and Zion does not have the passing ability of LeBron, bruh, or Luca, or any, or Ja. Look easy. Stretches the floor. The new concept for Valentunas. In his first five years, he attempted just four triples total. If you love the pressure he's putting on them, almost had that steal. Fantastic anticipation. He has active hands. Even though he doesn't call oh my God. over, he's disrupting their offensive charge. The three from charge. And again, it's Memphis with a three. They're, they're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five All right, cool. are from three points. <laughs> and there hasn't been anything easy for him in this period. As you've seen, they've made numerous attempts to try to get him going. Shows how valuable he is to this offense. And it's Parker with the ball, bringing it up for Boston. 19-point game. <laughs> Here's Williams. <laughs> no good that <laughs> They have scored dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor. Top five, not top three, bruh. Nothing went right on that offensive possession except for LeBron, Curry, and KD. Simple. Right now, yep. LeBron, Curry, and KD. Kawhi. 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 And this is his third trip to the line tonight. And he makes both free throws. Impeccable from the line. 
And listen, and listen, and at five, and at five, I'll probably squeeze James Harden there before I put Giannis. <laughs> Come on, bro. Come on, dog. And here at the end of the third it's not even. It's game. not even a comparison. This nigga said James Harden is better than Curry. Rebound by Williams. What a defensive play gets the stop and does it with What? That was James Harden Achilles heel. He couldn't get past the Warriors. It's been ice cold. Just can't seem to get anything to go his way. Moran got 14 points now in the second. Let it on the heat. Gotta love watching Moran. Get after it. He, he goes all out. Last playoff run uh, last year uh, got got swept by LeBron. Never quit battling on the offensive glass. Hamstring. Out of here. Working hard, beating everyone to the ball. He does this night in. I'm coming back before the playoff. Smart got his first basket. For a guy who's still working on the the interior. And the three off target. Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. I can see he's pressing a little now, trying desperately to help them shrink this deficit. Their round, their round is the conference finals, bro. Stolen by Smart. Pass to Parker. The kick out to Wood. Oh, and the jam by Williams. Yeah, he is a buddy prospect. I like whenever Williams shows that determination on offense, and it looks like he wants to just take over. If you look back at that 2019 draft, Zion goes one, Morant goes two, and with everything we know about them now, could you imagine having to make that choice today? That is a tough choice, GA. Or even crazier, could you imagine having both of them on your team? The reason why I say that, as amateurs, they played together in South Carolina. Little did they know at the time, they would be the future of this league. Legit Mike going in and out. Memphis leading by 16. Legit uh, Robotic. With the steal. Speak again, Drake. <laughs> Oh, well, you left. Ah, oh, you're fry. Uh, you're fry, Kevin. Yeah, 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 yeah for sure. <laughs> Cause I'm, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking at the, uh, I'm looking at the. Uh, come on, bro. He ain't have no squad. As you're trying to help your team finish the job. I don't think I have him beat above uh, Giannis. And again, Memphis, no good. Celtics trail by twelve. Yes, Nello. No good there, and that would have cut us to single digits. I said that would be Giannis' cutoff point right there, bro. So it's Philly. They're number one in the well, number two in the East. Nets. Please protect the ball around. Yes. The He's looking for the steal and opportunity to run. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Grizzlies. Contested shot and block shot. That's been their bread and butter defensively, giving up no easy luck. Yep, I hope you I hope you know that. All rookie first team honors after a brilliant first year. Tatum uh, Anderson wide open. He isn't. You know why he's in it. You know why he is in the MVP. You know why he. You know why he's not in the MVP conversation. Cause you see what he did the last two years. He won it. 
lose first and second round. Lose second round, basically. Yes, that does. Every MVP is supposed to be in the finals, bro. Period. Yes. Every MVP, either in the conference finals or finals, bro. Yes, that does. Yes, it does. Because Giannis, we could, Giannis is averaging better numbers in his MVP season, bro. Giannis is averaging better numbers in his MVP season. And it's not even in the race. You know why? Because they know if they vote him, he's going to lose second round to probably the Heat again. Speak, bro. When it what? Percentages. The other team has to be happy that this wasn't a bigger loss. This yes, it does. Yeah, Kevin, it, it, it's always frustrating. Bro, when you can't throw a rock on the ground. Every MVP goes to the conference conference finals or finals, bro. Really phenomenal all around game for John Morant. He really played at his preferred. Because there's a bunch of LeBron haters. Adjustments by the defense. Point back period. Beat him up or slow him down. So it's Parker with it. He'll bring it up for Boston. They trail by 18. Nobody near Williams. Again, the miss by the Celtics. And they double up Moran. From deep, Brooks. Bro, no. Outside. And it's just competing. You know, giving your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. Here's Jackson. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. It's on Double average. And of course, Jaron Jackson Sr. played in the NBA cool. for over a decade. He said Russell Westbrook was the best in the league. About watching his dad. Learning what it takes to be <laughs> professional. Ooh, love it, love it. <laughs> no, bro. How seriously Brown takes no, bro. his ability to score. He has the green light to fire from just about anywhere on the court. <laughs> Morant, right side. The tray. Parker with the steal. It's smart with the drive. The best of offensive interference. Unanimous, unanimous MVP. Morant outside. In the corner, it's Valanciunas. Fires the three. Connects from three-point range. They just blocked out the noise. Kept on grinding. And this is their reward. And guess what? It's going to be a fun fly yeah. Total team ever. But... <laughs> The Russell Westbrook, the Russell Westbrook story, the Russell Westbrook story was, uh, KD left the war, KD left the Thunder, went to the Warriors. Russell Westbrook on revenge. Russell Westbrook wants revenge and is averaging a triple double. 